Good morning, Mike. And it's a nice start to the day in the metro. It's 63 degrees right now. East southeast wind at 5 miles per hour. Winds not much of an issue for today. Taking a look at temperatures across the rest of the state 48 degrees in Taos, 44 in Alamosa, 64 in Santa Fe. Down to the south, even warmer. We're at 66 in Roswell and 77 at this hour in Carlsbad. Taking a look at the satellite and radar, nothing but clear skies across the entire state. And that will be the case as we go through your Wednesday. Taking a look at the Blitz Planner, we have lots of sunshine on the way through not only the noon hour, but also into the afternoon. We'll be at 82 degrees at noon into the mid 90s by 5 o'clock. From the weather to your Wednesday morning news blitz. The Columbus, New Mexico Village trustee currently in jail and accused in a Mexico gun smuggling ring is refusing to step down because he claims he's innocent. The Columbus Board of Trustees say that they will seek a court order to remove Blas Gutierrez from his position. To get a tax break, all you might have to do is let a balloonist land on your property. This proposal is one of several ideas being floated around to help pilots hit the ground safely at the balloon fiesta. This morning, Governor Martinez will participate in the unveiling of the official New Mexico Centennial hot air balloon. The unveiling will take place at 7 a.m. at the Albuquerque International Balloon Museum. Adam Richmond, host of the popular travel channel show Man vs. Food Nation, goes local tonight. In this evening's episode, Adam and friends take on New Mexico's biggest food challenges, including the world's largest sopapilla from Sadie. And the New Mexico Film Office has a new director. Nick Maniatis will take over and begin his new duties starting tomorrow. And that does it for your Wednesday morning headlines.